Hello students, I am Krishna Kumar and today I am going to discuss an important question asked by UPSC. In 2021 that question is marriage regulation, right, and alliance theory. This question is asked by UPSC in 2021 and we have to write our answer in 150 words. This is our limitation because we have to write our answer in 150 words. So how we write our answer? within 150 words of this question. So question answer writing is very important thing. If you want to qualify UPSC and if you want to get very good rank, very high rank or if you want to get a very good marks in anthropology or any other subject even in GS. So I will start a answer writing program at Old Rajan Nagar, Delhi at Krishna's IS from 8 August at 4 p.m. and from 13 August at 11 a.m. So this program is mainly focus how to write answer and I will provide you a special training for answer writing so you have to develop very good skill for answer writing and I think if you join with me in that answer writing training program you will have developed very smart technique for writing of answer in right perspective this is your requirement if you want to qualify right so that will be very beneficial for those students who will have appeared in this year and who will have targeted to 2023 but this course is a more beneficial to that a student who have been prepared their syllabus right in a right perspective those who want to join with me they will have to come in my class at 8 August 2022 at 4pm right at Old Rajan Nagar so this is information this is information i have given you but today we will try to understand how to write answer about that question so in this program i will have to discuss more than 250 questions and their answer their format and therefore those who want to join with me in this program they will be welcome 
but at first we try to understand this thing how to write answer about that question Mary's revolution and Alan's theory so for answer writing everybody should develop very good command on their syllabus syllabus give us insight about the understanding of question so if you have seen our syllabus so we find in marriage regulation we have three types of regulation mentioned in our syllabus that is preferential marriage <coughs> first second is prescriptive and third is proscriptive right these three important thing mentioned in our syllabus in the topic of marriage right generally most of a student think that socio cultural anthropology is very simple very easy but if you try to see about question asked by upsc recently so upsc has integrated topic related to anthropological theories with socio cultural anthropology right so in this topic we have to deal that the marriage regulation by the theory of alliance or alliance theory so that alliance theory proposed by claud levi strauss and he was the founder of structuralism in anthropology right theory of structuralism in anthropology and he was very famous anthropologist who have given very new insight for the understanding of social structure kinship structure or human culture right so basically claude levi strauss proposed his theory of structuralism and on the basis of that day, he tried to explain various socio cultural aspect of mankind so basically in this question we will have to give attention on on alliance theory right we have to give attention on alliance theory and how that alliance theory is interrelated with marriage regulation this is very important for us so the basic notion of claude levi strauss structuralism right structuralism that was influenced by linguistic structuralism so this their basic notion is that social structure kinship structure is the reflection of mental structure of mankind right it is the reflection of mental structure of mankind so he talked about human mental structure right or human thinking process human thought and he said that human mental structure work in binary opposition function in binary opposition so that is based on the theory of 
binary opposition right and on the basis of that theory of binary opposition cloud levy strauss explain about various phenomena in human society and culture but here we have to give attention about alliance theory so in alliance theory he said that insistable is the product of human mental structure according to binary opposition because human mind always think in binary opposition so insistable develop in human society due to binary opposition due to human mental structure due to human mental process because we think different way for i and u there is or me or we we think in different way so because we think in different way so my sister and your sister this concept develop in human mind because my sister is my sister so i can't make sexual relationship with our own sister but i can make sexual relationship with another uh, person's sister your sisters so this is thought process develop in human mind due to binary opposition ध्यान ही रखना है कि जो लिवी स्ट्रॉस कह रहे हैं कि जो ह्यूमन मेंटल स्ट्रक्चर है वो अपोजिशन में काम करता है तो एक व्यक्ति जो है अपनी सिस्टर को अपना मानता है दूसरी की सिस्टर को दूसरा मानता है सो बिकॉज वी कांट मेक सेक्स फॉर रिलेशनशिप वी कांट डू मैरी विथ आवर ओन सिस्टर बट आई कैन make sexual relationship with your sisters or do marriages with your sisters so due to this binary opposition insistable develop in human society human social structure and that insistable initiate exchange of women exchange of women in human society so exchange of women is the fundamental ways for the development of alliance for the development of marriage family and kinship structure right try to understand they want to see that alliance developed due to insistable that exchange is started due to development of insistable at that insistable develop due to binary opposition and that binary opposition is the reflection of human mental structure right so exchange of women is started and that exchange of women started in two way first restricted exchange right and general exchange 
जनरल एक्सचेंज ये बात ध्यान में रखना है कि रेस्ट्रिक्टेड रेस्ट्रिक्टेड एक्सचेंज मीन्स डायरेक्ट एक्सचेंज ऑफ वीमेन डायरेक्ट एक्सचेंज ऑफ वीमेन बिटवीन टू ग्रुप राइट फोर मैरस सो ही सेड दैट ड्यू टू इंसेबू देर वॉज इवोल्यूशन ऑफ एक्सचेंज ऑफ वीमेन इन ह्यूमन सोसाइटी सो फर्स्ट देर वॉज रेस्ट्रिक्टेड एक्सचेंज मीन्स डायरेक्ट एक्सचेंज ऑफ वीमेन बिटवीन टू ग्रुप फोर मैरिज एंड देयर फोर ड्यू टू दैट रेस्ट्रिक्टेड एक्सचेंज देयर इज डेवलपमेंट ऑफ सिमेट्रिकल अलायंस राइट मीन्स टू ग्रुप आर एक्सचेंजिंग देयर सिस्टर फूड मैरिज एज फॉर एग्जाम्पल हियर वन ग्रुप इज ए एंड दिस ग्रुप पे हैज टू पर्सन दैट इज B and so A has done marry with the the sister of B and B has also done marry with the sister of A. So here there is exchange of women for marriages. this types of exchange found in many moiety like institution society and a, their classical example is karira of australia right so this is exchange of women and this is symmetrical alliance and that the symmetrical alliance is related with prescriptive marriages regulation right and that proscriptive marriages regulation related with incest taboo means here prohibition of marriages between two individual who belongs from very close society close relatives and it is also related with preferential marriage if you try to observe so try to make interrelation between marriage regulation and alliance theory so first that is symmetrical alliance in general exchanges there is no direct exchange of women between two group because here group more than two means 3 4 5 6 7 8 and all group exchanging indirectly their women with each other and hence there is development of a symmetrical alliance a symmetrical alliance right in this group one is a and another is b another is c so b has done marriage marriage with the the sister of a c has done marriage with the sister of b and a has done marriage with the sister of c so this 
types of alliance develop in circular fear path in a circle that will in circle if alliances uh, alliance uh, made between more than people more than group 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so this is symmetrical alliance and that symmetrical alliance and and that asymmetrical alliance and symmetrical alliance form about kinship structure so if we try to understand about interrelationship between marriage regulation and alliance theory you can understand that thing so Claude Levi Strauss said that alliance theory is the fundamental model for the understanding of kinship structure in human society but in this question, you have also right on their limitations, right? And four limitations, first are Nidham has criticized about alliance theory, right? Another important thing is that if we accept this alliance theory, so it means here we support the exchange of women for marriage so women is not a property right but he tried to explain women as a property so therefore it has some limitations but in conclusion about that limitations that alliance theory gave us very new insight for the understanding of marriage regulation and kinship structure of human society right and therefore that is very useful for the understanding of social structure or kinship structure of human society on the basis of that you can write your answer right once again i I will give you information. I will start answer writing question, answer program for anthropology from 8 August at 4 p.m. at Old Rajendra Nagar at Krishna's IS. Thank you.